Hi friends, uh, today basically I got a uh, uh, interesting uh, results in my analytics account for one of my website that uh, a couple of uh, traffic basically uh, uh, coming from the different spam source which is I, I usually not recognize. Uh, so I'm just sharing uh, this information with you so that you can also you can prevent this kind of issues and you can sort it out uh, uh, how you can sort it out that issues that will be uh, today's uh, uh, videos objectives. So let's look into the my accounts. I have entered into my Google Analytics account. Uh, this is my accounts for the, the uh, uh, Compete Infotech Academy websites. So it's an educational website. Uh, I'm showing you the, the, the websites. Uh, which is basically I'm tapping up. This is competeinfotechacademy.com. So uh, I think you heard about this website before also because this is a website which is basically uh, providing the digital marketing and uh, entrepreneurships related programs for the uh, for the entrepreneurs and the upcoming uh, job seekers professionals. So, uh, so this is a website. So, this is a pretty good website with the pics and all the details uh, 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 and uh, resources. And uh, as per the observations, so Streamwork observation wise, so nothing has uh, happened uh, pre uh, last seven years basically. So, with the uh, dedicated SEO activities and uh, the people are quite qualified when they are, have done the activities and when they are working on this website. But uh, uh, the suddenly what I have noticed that uh, uh, in analytics some of the uh, traffic I am recognizing that is basically coming through the, the different portals like look at this, this is the Pornhub forums, this is something says like uh, free share buttons, reference is coming up, best SEO offer is coming up, buttons for website.com is coming up uh, uh, along with. So uh, uh, when I dig into this, uh, uh, into the Googles that uh, how it, we can make it uh, like uh, whether it is the, what is these sites uh, and I have typed it into the, the search engine browser, look at this. This is a lot of things is uh, uh, coming up in this uh, uh, Google search like I have been getting into the heat from this websites and all. So this is a, a pretty good results is coming up from the lot of people are facing the same issues. So I dig into the more things and uh, uh, and uh, the, for the prevention wise I immediately catch it up the the HD access. So let's see, look into the, the my HD access files. So this is uh, my filezilla. I have opened it in, in front of you. So this is my HD access. So what I did, I just download uh, my HD access files to check and immediately deleted all the uh, the unnecessary uh, traffic coming from the different uh, unknown sources i want to prevent it so uh, what i did i have created one uh, one um, a folder uh, with the name of compete infotech uh, academy and uh, i just uh, make the download the dot access file look at this so it's downloading into my systems so it's coming up into the dot .stss files now what happened now what happened uh, like I'm opening the dot .stss files so I'm using it in a notepad so look, this is a pretty clean uh, .stss files where we have redirected the uh, the uh, non dot dot uh, dot compete infotech academy dot com sites to the uh, uh, www dot so that we can uh, solve the issues for the canonical issues and we have a uh, redirections for the 404 error page. So it's a pretty clear HTXS, nothing wrong with it. So but uh, we are uh, recognizing this kind of unknown traffic. So how we should uh, uh, protect these things and how we can recover these issues. Let's look into it. So for this I have created another uh, code uh, like uh, this size I have identified. These all are the basically a uh, size which is coming for the uh, spam list. This is all of the spam source. So I have created a list. Look at this is a this is a star and the website and the dot com is coming. The extensions is coming with a slash. So this file see, I am copying it and I am saving it into the my existing HTXS files. So I am putting this code over here. 
okay so I think this is fine yeah so I'm saving it and I'm uploading it for my .stxs files so just overwrite it so your solutions will be lies within this like look at this this is a code basically I am sharing in my videos so that you can copy it exact course into your .stxs files so that you can prevent this kind of spammy websites traffic into your website because as you know if it is coming from this kind of unknown sources in that cases the google can track and it can uh, 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 blo block your size for the, the search engine ranking part so it can hamper your organic search results so definitely you should uh, uh, protect this kind of unknown sources which is uh, uh, spammy and which is uh, coming for the, the, the different spam sources so it should be uh, rectified through this way uh, uh, through uh, .stxs files so friends uh, i hope you enjoyed this videos and uh, if you are facing this kind of issues in uh, 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 right now and if you are facing this issues in future so i think this videos will help you to uh, protect to prevent your websites and uh, it will be uh, like useful for your cases also thank you very much